We have no other business to do. Fine? Uh, should the CMOS be written module wise or it is comprehensive wise? Difficulty one can do, but uh, with a proper definition of course outcome, that's the meaning. That's why I said, otherwise it could have been a module outcome. Otherwise it could have been called as a module outcome. Is that right? Huh. How she was our uh, instructor? Huh? Huh? She designed the course, a lot of, lot of things. Fine? She was. Of all the things uh, we have, what we should teach, so that it is a guide which we are roadmap for us. Uh, decide how best to teach, so that uh, uh, how to how best to assess, communicate the expectations to the students. This is very important because at the end of the course, if I give this list to the student. And if he thinks this teacher doesn't give anything, so let me happily enjoy. If he has a, 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 an enrolled in the beginning, and at the end, if I screw them and then give a course outcome, then he is killed. Getting my point? That's why I said this point is very important. Communicate my expectations. See, if you are enrolled under me, you must face this top chair. If you are ready, then no leave you come. Otherwise, don't come and get failed and, uh, I mean, abusing me. Getting my point? That's the meaning. So that's what I said. What are our decisions on the above matters? We can always present to that. So uh, they are valuable data for improving instruction and increasing student learning process. How to decide on number of CMOS? Content. Fine. Contact hours or credits? If it is just a two credit and if you make a uniform policy, hey, write six CMOS, what that poor teacher will write? If it is just for one or two credits, can you write six CMOS? Definitely not. Because our engagement is for a short duration. Can be. At least institution should make a policy for one credit courses, it can be two or three. Six credits, I mean, or three or four credits, make it six. Like that. A uniform policy can be made, but uh, uh, why a uniform policy cannot be like that. All CMOS should be there. Why? Across all the courses. Then what teacher will do? Same thing with a new English, lot of overlapping. He will give, because teachers will do anything. <laughs> then he will create or they will decide. What they will do? Okay. Uh, what are the points need to be considered for writing the CMOS? My advice is, uh, that's what I said, people consider Bloom's taxonomy, fine, if you follow, I have no disregard for that. But my practice is to fall in line with pivots, that's all. If I use the action words used in the pivots, directly I can. What the advantage of that? That's the same thing. It becomes an easy task. So that we can say, straight away this matter. How CVOs will help? That's what I said. So a day may become they are enabling them to truly become master of the content and take uh, guessing how the students attempt to learn. That means you can't keep them always guessing what this teacher will expect. So you are very clear, this is my expectation. No guess on me. Because you would have read, it is a useless teacher, he asked you so much. So let me stay away from you. So there is no guess. There is a clarity. Uh, university affiliated colleges, can they write their own symbols? Any affiliated colleges? Right now? Yeah. So, can you write? Yes. If CBOS written by the university is matching with your delivery and assessment also, then you can keep it. So that not that if something a fancy item you prepare. That's what I have written. So that if they are matching with your delivery and assessment methods, then it's fine. Else, you can modify both. both of them. Then should we write uh, equal number of symbols or so I already said so that uh, better to go with a uniform policy but that the policy should be I mean uh, supporting a lower number of credits, less number of symbols. Uh, Blue stacks only need to be considered, not compulsory but preferred. Right? Is it not? Well, most of you might be following. following. Only additional uh, uh, scratching of your head you are making, whether it becomes real, real, or I don't scratch my head for that. Uh, how many pivots can I map to a given CMOS? 
Just right now we have understood the pivots. Sivo starting you will see. So how many pivots? If I write, let us say one x course, five course outcomes. So each course outcome to how many advisable? How many pivots can I map? That's my question. No, no. Number of let us say five sivos are there. Five given course. Let us say another guy from X course. Five course outcomes are there. So each of the sivo. How many program outcomes will I be able to map? In a realistic sense. Two or three. Two or three. Right, two even scalars. One or two. Because it's building the evidence in the sense, assessing them to do such a challenging task. Because each is an expectation from the program. It's a very tough task. Even three also acceptable unless until if you are challenging student to that level. I am not telling three is a wrong answer. From morning I have been telling that these are all relative views. They are not binary answers. Whatever we are discussing, they are all relative views. Relative views are always like keep changing, keep changing. You know, even in relative grading, what happens? Grading keeps changing sometimes. Highest marks may be a worst grade, so it's like related. But somewhere in the band we will always be the same. So according to me, with an exception with the project. Project work is something different. There are a lot of independent plus in team work, I mean uh, communication, uh, analysis, design, so many things will come. So with that as an exception, otherwise I will say one to two is advisable. Uh, is CO very much into TLP? Yes. Yes. How should I measure CO's? Seven so shortly you will be listening. Are CO's attainable a project percent as a target? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you have seen. There is no scope for it. If you say it is 100%, no scope for it. What's the program articulation matrix and course articulation matrix? It's nothing but a COP and mapping and mapping. Can a COP be written by a bit more than one competency? Yes, but advice to separate out, I mean separate out them. Okay. Like some uh, COs people might have written, able to design and analyze. Both together, it's uh, very difficult to separate them out. So better write that separately, this separately. Because now I have made a statement that it's a nuisance. Later you have to realize. Rather than that, avoid. Uh, then, are graduate and residential pivots one and the same? Yes, yes, yes. 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 Yes, Articulation form of graduate attributes. Both are cannot be same. POs are always articulated form of graduate attributes. Graduate attributes are only keywords. So don't read graduate attributes and be complacent until that I know all POs. That's what I, I don't know, I mean, say it right there, but it's not coming. Fine, this already I said. Yeah. Yeah, uh, has any my friend Guru Prasad has spoken about this? Yes. He has spoken? Oh, CVOS. Because this is the computer science example itself, which I have picked up. If at all he has spoken, I will skip this. Fine. Okay, fine, I will run through fast. So, a typical course is taken where uh, computer science people will uh, agree and appreciate, where Rana is a very popular course. Fine. I am not willing to share with the students, but every year you keep on adding small contribution to the work of that form. Then your stock becomes small. That's, that's the message what I am trying to give. Otherwise, if you start hunting for the questions only at the time of a continuous internal retaliation, it becomes very difficult. I just give you the previous day for the scanning Rather than that, Yeah.
This is something that I have so far. You are free, is it? You are free, so which kind of thing that you are? A pair of marriage. That would be at least happily you can ultimately marry to be with her. I'm like it. What are the possible questions? Something like this. Is it? Something like this. Computer science people, you are free.
become more much. As a captain, yes, too. As a freedom, as a goal, as a passion, all of So meaning to say, there are exceptions like magic work where there can be nothing. That's only the message, not to promote the brain. Okay? Yeah. 